Hey guys, this is Monster Jam Historian, back with another video. Join us now as we cover the results from the Atlanta Motor Speedway shows and discuss the latest news including BJ Johnson out of retirement, lineup changes for Indianapolis and San Antonio, a new look for Samson with a new driver, and much more. Be sure to subscribe for more videos like this and let's jump straight into the results. Monster Jam made their first ever appearance at the legendary Atlanta Motor Speedway for four action-packed shows. As always, I'll be recapping the shows briefly, but for more in-depth results, you can check out the results page on MonsterJam.com. Jumping into the first show of the weekend, Tom Mentz and Max D defeated Ryan Anderson and Bakugan Dragonoid for the first ever racing win in Atlanta Motor Speedway. Mentz would add to his impressive racing win by winning the Skills Challenge with a 9.334. Two-time Monster Jam World Finals Champion Todd LaDuke and Monster Energy would win Freestyle with a 9.448. Taking the first overall event championship of the weekend was Tom Mentz in Max D. On to the second show, as Ryan Anderson would make his way back to the final round of racing. This time, he would come out on top, defeating Todd LaDuke in Monster Energy. Taking his first ever skills win was Zach Garner in Wild Side with two amazing moonwalks. Maxi's Tom Mentz would win Freestyle with an impressive 9.317. Adding on to his spectacular win in the skills challenge, Zach Garner in Wild Side would take his first overall event championship. After the action-packed Saturday shows, Show 3's racing winner would be Ryan Anderson in Bakugan Dragonoid, defeating Todd LaDuke in Monster Energy once again. Ryan Anderson in Bakugan Dragonoid would take his first skills win in Atlanta, earning himself a 9.448. Baru Musawa would put Zombie on the map by taking the freestyle win with a 9.335. Your overall event champion would be Tyler Duke in Monster Energy. And for the final show in Atlanta, Racing saw Tom Mentz in Max D defeat Tyler Duke in Monster Energy. Taking skills was Adam Anderson in Megalodon, and Freestyle was taken by Bad Company's John Gordon. Your overall event championship was won by Baru Musawa in Zombie. Atlanta Motor Speedway had some of the best shows in recent Monster Jam history. Drivers got to compete on one of the most unique tracks in Monster Jam history, and all drivers made the most of it. Drivers like Zach Garner and John Gordon added some wins to their name, while other drivers kept up their dominance and added to their already impressive belt. That's it with the results, let's jump straight into the news. First up, Brianna Mahan returns. Brianna Mahan was an amazing driver who unfortunately was laid off last year due to the pandemic. Later in the week, it was announced Brianna is making her return behind the wheel of Scooby-Doo in Wichita, Kansas. She made a name for herself when she was driving Whiplash, but it's great to see her back in Monster Jam, this time behind the truck that got Brianna her start in Monster Jam. Next up, is Adam Anderson back in Gravedigger? Fans are super excited to see Adam Anderson back behind the wheel of the black and green wrecking machine known as Gravedigger. Adam will be driving Gravedigger in Indianapolis and San Antonio, and it is currently undecided if he will be driving Gravedigger in any other shows. What do you think of Adam returning to Gravedigger? Let me know in the comments down below. Up next, new additions to lineups to upcoming shows. Lots of drivers have been added in to upcoming shows throughout the schedule. Lindsay Reed will be driving Monster Mutt Dalmatian Galaxy in St. Louis, filling in for Cynthia Gauthier. Elvis Linez will be making his debut in the second Great Clips Mohawk Warrior in Charleston and Oklahoma City, getting his chance to show his skills. Drivers being added to the Indianapolis shows include Axe with Chris Kohler, Gravedigger Adam Anderson, and Monster Mutt Dalmatian Galaxy Lindsay Reed. Drivers being added to the San Antonio shows include Brutus, Craig Champion, Gravedigger Adam Anderson, Jurassic Attack Paul Jensen, Megalodon Tristan England, Monster Mutt Dalmatian Galaxy Cynthia Gauthier, and Vendetta Mike Christensen. Our next story is a new look for Samson and a new driver. Dan Patrick Samson is one of the most legendary and iconic monster trucks of all time. It was revealed earlier this week that not only would Samson sport a new look, but also have a new driver behind the wheel. 
former Monster Energy driver Cody Saussier has been announced as the driver of Samson. Cody Saussier has been keeping himself busy after his release from Fell due to the pandemic. Cody has even helped out the Samson crew for the Outlaw Monster Truck drags, and it's awesome to see Cody behind the wheel once again. What do you think of Cody behind the wheel of Samson? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. And finally, BJ Johnson out of retirement? Huge news came out from BJ Johnson as it was revealed that he was going to pilot the all-new wildcard truck for the Swansons. BJ announced his retirement from the sport early last year, and fans are more than excited to see BJ back in a monster truck. What are your thoughts of BJ coming out of retirement? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below, and I will see you all next time for some more monster truck content.